you have Instagram? No. Snapchat? Still no. Then what do you have? A life? We are here to bake a cake. We are so bored with all this quarantining that we've decided to just take matters into our own hands. Excuse the remote control, but here are all the recipes. And we are gonna bake a cake today. Uh, right, guys? guys? For our dad, yeah. yeah. For your dad? Yes. Girl, it's for us. Uh, yeah. Yes. And I was thinking we could slip a slice for my teacher for doing everything for me. Do you know when school's gonna be open? It might not be open for a very long time. Mm, I can wait that long. <laughs> shit I've ever seen. This girl stopped at the gas station to pump gas and she came out with this. <laughs> Hi guys. Hey y'all. Welcome back to our channel. Welcome, welcome. We are the Yusufs. If you don't know us, I'm Nunai. And I'm Mustaha. And we primarily make videos about fashion, lifestyle, mostly fashion. Mostly stuff about our life and vlogs. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Um, so if you don't know anything about us, make sure you subscribe so you can get to know us. And hit that little bell so that you can be notified every time we post. Yeah, so today's video, we kind of... Ooh, look at that sunlight. Oh, okay, sis. Okay, so in today's video, we wanted to talk about something really serious. Yes. My nails. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I get with you. So um, seriously, we wanted to talk about something serious. We kind of just wanted to talk about what's going on with the whole coronavirus and like this whole quarantining situation and how we're handling it and how like we're all just stuck at home and and how it's affecting our business. I just want to kind of sit down and kind of let you guys know what our plans are and how we're gonna just take make the best of this time. Yeah, and yeah. how we're gonna take advantage of this downtime because. Um, we normally are so busy that we have no time for ourselves. Yeah. Um, so we're gonna. What, what are what are our plans, sis? What? Let's let's roll what? up our sleeves. Okay, let's go and <laughs> figure things out. Okay? okay. So first things first. Um, I was you know the first thing I thought about when this happened was this is probably a well not a blessing in disguise but it's probably a blessing in disguise that we get to stay home um and slow down a bit because i feel like it's it's been such a whirlwind for the la like the last year yeah. um we barely have any time to like you know work on ourselves like we like and yeah like our our weight loss and health has been like uh, put on the, the back burner the back burner definitely like i personally get like zero time well not zero time but like i think i get a far less time with my kids than i usually would it's like it's definitely to. a challenge yeah, yeah so i think with this time like i the most important thing for me is well obviously my kids are home and i have no choice but to like homeschool and do all that stuff with them yes. but i think the most important thing that i want to take advantage of this time is um just focusing on my health and my you know like my weight loss Sorry, is, he really is he talking to us <laughs> can you guys get out of here turn it off so my biggest focus right now we're gonna, we're gonna take a few journeys yeah right? yeah so journeys the first one is we want to prioritize our um weight loss journeys mm -hmm. because we're both at a place right now where we're not really happy with our weight yeah and um we were on a journey to slowly it was very slow because every week is like so the, crazy busy with the traveling and you know the constant working it's like sometimes yeah. you just fall off and, and it's, it's like, so hard to like yeah. fit in a workout um every single day when you have so many tasks to just get through yeah so now that we don't have any tasks we're definitely gonna we ain't got no choice but to work on we ourselves we don't have a choice so we're gonna do yeah. it we're gonna show up in summer 2020 with fire bodies okay <laughs> and you know what some of you keep telling me my clothes are too tight watch out you know what watch your back because you better watch you. out okay <laughs> <laughs> so anyway here's here's our our plan yes so like let's so, break it down so for the last week we have been running mm -hmm. you know because we can while well, we still can yes um just you know kind of just like enjoying the fresh air now that it's spring yeah um, the weather here is really nice by yeah. the way, past couple of, it's been raining a couple of days but it's really yeah. nice yeah and then we've also been we are on this 30 day challenge so we're basically challenging each other and we would 
we think we, you guys should all join us. Whoever yes. is like down to join, you should probably join us too. Because mm-hmm. we're going to be documenting it. And I think we're going to just kind of do like a weekly vlog yeah. of our journey. Mm-hmm. And uh, we've been running. We have eating been clean. eating clean. So, so we, we're on a 30 day, we have a 30 day challenge yeah. where we are eating clean. And working out. And working out. Yes. So join us guys yes. we might all look snatched in summer and we've been doing a lot of like um skincare yeah. and like masks um hair masks face masks everything that has to do with taking care of yourself and just glowing up yeah because summer is coming and we're not always going to be in coronaville right it's going <laughs> to be behind us we're going to get through this it's going to be okay yeah. and yeah why not just like show up looking your best once all once this the is apocalypse over? is over like it's not always gonna be like this you know it's very important to like stay positive focusing on our energy with this time on you know bettering ourselves like mm-hmm. our physical body our mental well-being by just kind of like chilling out and mm-hmm. just reading a book here and there t- putting on some face masks i think it's like in general it's staying positive and you know just staying away from all of this negative news and negative like negativity in general surrounding coronavirus like we just want to kind of take it back a notch and not worry so much about all of this chaos yes absolutely yeah so um include like aside from like staying positive and all of that obviously we have to stay informed and like stay knowledgeable about what's going on in the world as well and definitely take it seriously Mm -hmm. um i know that we've been practicing social distancing um we've been staying informed about what's going on washing our um, hands washing our hands sanitizing sanitizing, um and also just being a human being you know you don't have to run to the store and buy out all the hand sanitizers or toilet paper or whatever you know so everybody just chill out but at at the same time do your part and do your part yes um and you know don't travel if you don't have to like obviously we miss traveling um and just like seeing all of this stuff with italy is like really breaking our hearts because you know as you guys know we we were there like not too long ago ago. dancing in the streets and doing all this ridiculous things and having fun and it's really heartbreaking it's so heartbreaking just yesterday i heard that there was like 450 deaths in 24 hours and from what they're projecting that the u.s is gonna be on a similar path yeah. so we're just trying really hard to like focus and make sure that we are doing our part to like you know um keep those around us healthy keep ourselves healthy especially and our like the elderly yeah. and you know small children people that are already have compromised immune systems just really be careful um and let's just all get together and well not get together <laughs> let's not get together don't leave your house if you don't have to <laughs> but um but yeah we just wanted to obviously make that a point yeah um so i think the takeaway from this video is use this time direct that energy to do something better for yourself because that's what we're doing you Mm -hmm. should join us um i think it's a lot better um way to you know quarantine than to just sit there and eat all the snacks in your house yeah i think you don't want to run doing that for like the first couple of weeks (laughs) i literally ate all of my stash that i bought for the coronavirus okay (laughs) and i don't know who's gonna do my nails but just bite to, those off sis i'm gonna have to like eat these <laughs> off and just start fresh when this is over yeah <laughs> um but yeah um guys thank you so much for watching this video if you've lasted this long we just wanted to say hi you yeah, know exactly. and just give you guys an update as to what we're doing because mm-hmm. everybody just needs to like check in on each other these yeah. times absolutely and um yep yeah, we're just staying positive and hopefully we will see better days mm-hmm. um and we'll just stay busy i guess and yeah. entertain y'all yeah. in the meantime but yeah i guess we will see you guys in our next video thanks bye. for watching bye good morning what's up y'all so it's day one of our fitness challenge our 30-day fitness challenge um and i'm just at the track by my house um i was actually supposed to meet up with my sister today um to start this journey together but sis was not answering my phone calls i guess she forgot to set her alarm or something but um i'm still gonna just go ahead and start on my own um this is my first time coming here it's pretty nice i guess it's like some sort of like a stadium or something because it's huge there's already people here jogging, walking their dogs. Um, so I feel safe by myself. 
because I was a little scared waking up at 7 a.m. to jog outside by myself just in case someone like snatches me. <laughs> but this is a really nice area. And I got some company. So let's get it. Oh, and don't mind my hair. It's a very wild one. It was literally touching the roof of my car on my drive here. Anyways, let's go!